at the same time as an English man. Jeff arranges a rendezvous with his first love, Patricia, to recapture their first affair in a Montmartre studio. The son of the concierge persuades his first love Simone to climb up to the same studio bedroom. Window thinking it would be empty for the night. Meanwhile Jeff finds Patricia has grown bitter over the years. And that the warmth has gone from their relationship. But when they disturb the two young lovers in the bedroom. The evening ends in a humorous and more light-hearted manner. As they are forced to crawl under the concierge's door in order to leave unseen. Running late to school the concierge's son sees a young American girl. Who is studying at the American Hospital of Paris in Newley. And who is having an affair with an older doctor. Not only must they keep the affair secret from the concierge. But also from the disapproving general public by having to meet in shady hotels de passe. However an escape to the seaside in Normandy brings matters to a head between them. As the Second World War begins. In occupied Paris. Marcel, the managing director of an important cement business, arrives at the studio which he is renting for his mistress Josette, and bumps into a German Oberleutnant on the landing. As it is Christmas Eve, old enmities are put aside. But Marcel has to get his other Christmas presents home to his wife Helioise and also to his mother, who lives the other side of Paris all of whom offer Marcel the customary Christmas French dish of oysters, which are also given to him by his mistress for her party, along with her music teacher and her student Monsieur Grondin. The only form of transport in Paris during those war years were velo-taxis, a type of bicycle rickshaws, which are unable to get the overweight Marcel to all of his women in time for their oyster dinners. These he has to consume in a hurry, one after the other, in order to be on time, albeit a bit green around the gills, for a secret meeting with the French resistance. After the war all three men are reunited in the old studio.